Can you move? <laughs> Thanks. What's up? My name is Sawyer, and this is my YouTube channel. Uh, that was a little bit extra. I've wanted to do this video for a very, very long time now, but, um, when the trend kind of went around, I hadn't met that many YouTubers at the time. But now, since playlist happened, I can do it! <sighs> um, I know my setting's a little different, but that's gonna change soon. I'm gonna be going back home. Uh, right now I'm in Pennsylvania. And I'm vlogging it, so if you want to see those Pennsylvania vlogs, check out my vlog channel. I got some cool stuff going on. Let's get started. So, naturally, of course, I want to start with the first YouTuber I met, and that is uh, Ricky Dillon. He was awesome. Me and my mom went to his book tour. We met him and his friend Shelby, and I don't want to say her last name because I'm going to butcher it, but I have now met Shelby twice now because I met her at Playlist. Me and my mom went to his... Speaking of Ricky... He just tweeted. We went to his book tour and we met him and we took a few pictures. It was kind of fast because there was a long line, but we were at the beginning, like not the very front. But we were closer to the front of the line. It was awesome. I was very happy that Ricky just happened to be the first person, the first YouTuber that I met because he's also the first YouTuber who like noticed me on social media and I've looked up to him for a super long time now. So that's like really cool to me that he was the first person to notice me and he was the first YouTuber that I met. There's a picture with Shelby. Yeah. So I got my book signed and uh yeah, I actually made a story time about it a long time ago, like right after it happened, and it should be right there. Let's continue. Now I told myself that I was going to not include uh, YouTubers or internet people that I know personally, like my friends. Um, and technically, I technically, pfft, I still don't know this person personally yet. I've talked to him a good bit, which is actually really cool. It's Colin Barry. <laughs> so when I went to Playlist, I had been watching his videos for a long time. I told Sophia on the way there, on the way there. <laughs> I literally said, I want to meet Colin Barry. And she was like, who's that? So, because she didn't know who it was at the time. But, she is now a fan. And we both watch him and talk about him and all that good stuff. But, um, so, I had Playlist. My group that I was with, my mom, Sophia, and her mom, we kind of got split up in the hotel lobby. And I spotted Colin. He was talking to a supporter. <laughs> Oops. So I looked to my mom and I was like, hey, there's Colin. I'm going to go talk to him, uh, get a picture and stuff, and I'll be right back. <laughs> so I walked up to him, kind of feel bad because I kind of cut off the dude he was talking to. And Colin just kind of just like stopped talking to him and started talking to me. And the dude was like, really? He gave me a what the <laughs> look. And I was like, sorry. I literally, I said sorry. And he was like, oh, it's fine. So I didn't feel that bad about it. But I was like, hey, Colin, what's up? Can we get a picture? And he was like, yeah, but you had to follow me um, because I had to catch up to my friends. And I kind of really feel bad about this one because, like, he, he um, if you've seen, if you watch Colin's videos, you probably have seen the video. It was like a YouTuber stole my laptop. And this was that night. So, like, he had to catch up to his friend because I'm pretty sure he was looking for his laptop. I think he told me that's what it was. But, um, so he had to catch up to his friend. So I literally followed him, like, halfway across the hotel lobby. And, uh, we stopped and we took this picture. Once he caught up to his friends, we took this picture. He asked what my name was and I told him. And he was like, okay, your name's cool. And, uh, yeah, he was really nice. Um, it's really cool to meet YouTubers that are as tall as me. I think Ricky's as tall as me too, but like I'm super tall And it's cool to meet YouTubers that are as tall as me. It makes me feel less awkward And so he was super nice. We took the picture and uh Yeah, I'm glad <laughs> I'm glad he got to find his laptop and stuff after that Now this youtuber is actually one I've met uh, who is the most recent while I was actually in Pennsylvania I but I met Taylor Kniff at uh, one of his tour stops. I went, me and my mom went to his show, and I was kind of nervous because I didn't really know like what to do, kinda, because like it was me and a bunch of girls in line. But you know, it was awesome. Taylor goes, "Hey man, how are you? What's up?" Uh, because this was at his 
because this was at his merch table and uh, I bought one of his shirts because I've been wanting it for a long time. I wanted it since before I knew I was going to meet him because it's a cool shirt and a light per DM because I watched Chase and Cameron. But um, so he signed it right there. I like the shirt because it's like it's pretty cool looking, but uh, I'm going to be ripping that on the Insta soon. Anyway, so he said, what's up? How are you? And yeah, I got him to sign the shirt. He said, do you want me to sign this for you? And I was like, duh. Well, I didn't say duh, but you know. Yeah, I mean, what, why wouldn't I? Um, I'm going to go turn that off. Boom. So I got him to sign it, and then he went back to the picture part because the way it works, it was like the... Um, you sign your shirt, you say hi, and then you go to the picture part where you're, they have the backgrounds and stuff, and you take the picture. So, he walked back over, and I took the picture with him. I vlogged with him, which was really cool, and then um, I had a pose in mind anyway, because I was like, yo, Sophia. Side note, Sophia had met him already, and I had talked to her about the pose I was going to make. Anyway, what is this? I'm like, Pfft. And so, we took the picture. <laughs> And, uh, he actually tweeted it later, which was really cool, because he asked for, um, he asked people to tweet him meet and greet pictures, and I tweeted him mine, and I think he said something along the lines of, hey, my dude, we lit, or something like that, but there, I'll put a screenshot. Rawr. Now, these next two people are so great. Courtney and Christo, I met them at Playlist Live. Most of these stories are going to be from Playlist Live. Yeah, I knew who Courtney was, and I had heard of Christo, but I hadn't, like, known him that well when I met them but I'm a huge fan now because they're like both amazing and they do milk chocolate and those are great boom Courtney was talking to a supporter of his why do I feel like every story I'm talking about somebody was talking to a supporter and I interrupted oops didn't mean to so I waited and waited and waited because me and Sophia I was like Sophia there's Courtney and I've also got her into Courtney and Christo and Colin and pretty much everybody I talk about. She she knows who they are now and she loves them. So that's great. Um, so I was like, hold on, they're, they're, he's talking to somebody, so we'll wait. And then all of a sudden, Courtney looks up and goes, whoa, because he saw my name tag. And I'm assuming he'd seen my name from Twitter before um, because I tweet a lot. If you want to follow me, here's my Twitter. We talked for a little bit and he was really awesome. I'm out of breath. He asked how our playlist was going, and he showed us Christo, and we talked to Christo for a little bit. Uh, it was a good experience. We took this picture, and then uh, we said bye because we had to go. But uh, we met up with Courtney and Christo and Shelby later and took another picture. They had amazing lighting. Yeah, so Courtney and Christo and Shelby were all great. What, 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 what was that? So, one of the main reasons I went to Playlist Live was because my girl Gabby. I love the Gabby show so much. And Sophia knew it and Sophia met her with me. We had to wait in this line because we met her at a meetup. She was like the last in line. So we got up to her, I hugged her, thanked her for something kind of special. She hugged me even tighter, which was amazing because I love her. And then um, Sophia took her picture and then I vlogged with her. Pete, my playlist vlog it should be right there. She called me hot, which I think she says that to a lot of people, but it still meant a lot to me. And then she saw Sophia, and she was like, wow, that was just a hot couple. And I was like, <laughs> oh. To all these people anyway, because they're like all amazing, and I watch all their videos, and Musical.ly's, and you nows and Twitters, and Instagrams, and every social media possible. Here's our picture. Next person that I'm going to talk about was Hunter Roland. Um, I had looked up to him for a while too, and uh, he's pretty cool. So I was like, hey, we're gonna vlog. I didn't say it like that. I met him in a meetup as well, but it was a separate one. Walked up to him and I was like, do you care if we vlog? Once again, it's in my playlist vlog. I recorded the whole thing. We talked for a little bit. He said, hey, we should be brothers, which meant a lot to me, because that's kind of cool, because, you know, imagine somebody you look up to just saying, hey, we should be brothers. And then him and Zach, just had a conversation about how cool they thought my last name was. Which was kind of cool because my name is Sawyer, obviously. It was cool that they thought my last name was cool. A lot of YouTubers that I met thought my last name was cool, which meant a lot to me. So Hunter was pretty great too. Here's a picture. 
the next person we're going to be talking about, I looked up who they were um, because I saw that she was in the meetup uh, that I got and I watched her videos and I could not stop laughing so I automatically subscribed because her and her fiance are amazing and adorable and the couple goals and yeah so Natalie's outlet we met her in the meetup as well there's a huge dog she asked what my name was and I told her and she was like Sawyer Knight that almost sounds like Casey Neistat like that's one of those names that are memorable and I was like oh my god <laughs> so that was really cool then I said hi to Dennis and we took a picture with him couple squad Congratulations to Natalie and Dennis for getting engaged, by the way. And they were really awesome. So, yeah. Next person I'm going to be talking about is Chris Miles. I also met him at the Taylor show that I talked about towards the beginning of the video. Um, he was awesome. And uh, I vlogged with him as well. He asked what my name was. I told him and he said it like six times because I was trying to get it right. He got it right, which was cool because a lot of people say my name different. Not wrong, but different. Uh, so, yeah, that was kind of cool. So, thank you, and I just posted that picture on Instagram. So, if you see this video, comment the sunglasses emoji on that picture that I posted. But, Chris, if you see this video, boom. The last person I'm going to be talking about in this video is Edwin Burgos. Much like Natalie, I also looked him up because I saw that he was in this meetup that I was in. Watched him, subscribed. Him and Kylie are couple goals. I told him that in the vlog uh, because I vlogged with him. Because I vlog with everybody I meet. And he said thank you. And we took a picture. And he was awesome. And I still watch him and Kylie because they're amazing and couple goals. And well, every social media couple is couple goals. I wouldn't go that far. But Kylie and Edwin are couple goals. And they're amazing. And yeah. And here's the picture with Edwin. He started laughing, which was kind of funny because Sophia was being mean to me and uh, was telling me how to take the picture while I was videoing. And he thought it was funny, so he started laughing. So here's the picture. And then, uh, yeah, so that's going to be all I'm going to talk about today. Thankfully, I have been blessed and lucky enough to have met a good many of YouTubers I look up to. So if you'd like a part two exposing YouTubers, exposing nice YouTubers, uh, that I have met. I'll do a part two if this gets, mm, let's say, 25 likes. Can we try to do 25? Ding. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you so much for watching. I will see you guys next Sunday. Sorry I didn't upload this past Sunday, but I've been busy and working and vlogs and yeah, uh, no, that's not an excuse, but those vlogs will be up as well. So if you want to check out my vlog channel, it's right there. But thank you so much for watching. See you guys next Sunday, and uh, have a good day. Chill on the west side, playing my song. Got the key of soul with my cheap shades on. Gonna run right through the night. Jump off the gate, fall to the ground. It don't matter, still hitting this town. Oh, and now.